The Festiniog and Welsh Island Railways has been part of the North Wales scene for nearly 200 years. Ever changing and adapting, it represents heritage on a local and national level and has shared technology across the globe. The railway was created to link the slate mines of Blaenau Festiniog with a port in Porth Madog, and this enabled the slate to be transported across the world. The railway has a history of innovation which attracted global interest in the 19th century. It was the first narrow gauge line to successfully use steam locomotives back in the 1860s. Those locomotives and the buildings built to house them still remain in use and feature in our project today. The spirit of innovation within our railway lives on. We have a big story to tell about how the railway used technology to make the slate industry competitive. So much of the original material has survived, including the first bogey carriages here in the UK and the infrastructure here in Boston Lodge. We want to share this story to make sure our history is kept alive. Our railway was almost lost when it closed just after the Second World War. With the slate industry in decline, a very tired locomotive, Princess, hauled the last train in 1946 and the line was all but abandoned. A large amount of the equipment and buildings were simply left. In 1954, a brave new venture started as volunteers brought the railway back to life. Mile by mile, carriage by carriage and building by building. Huge challenges were overcome, including building 2.5 miles of new railway round a lake which had flooded the line. In the 90s, the Welsh Island Railway was also restored, taking over 20 years and costing more than 35 million to create the Festiniog and Welsh Highland Railways, the longest heritage line in the UK. Today, 190 years after the railway company first started, and nearly 70 years after the restoration of the line, we are stronger than ever. The operation of the railway as a tourist attraction has ensured that the heritage assets have survived and have been provided for. We are one of the largest attractions in North Wales, with over 200,000 visitors per year. At the heart of everything we do are our volunteers and members. With more than 700 volunteers and 6,000 members, more than half of what we do here at the railway is achieved through our volunteers. Our work here at Boston Lodge has recently been recognised as we received the prestigious Heritage Railway Association Award for Locomotive Preservation. We have reinvented our business several times over in order to make sure we have an attractive offer to those tourist visitors. Our modern carriages, sense of place and customer service helps differentiate us. In the years to come, we will further enhance our offer by making a step change improvement in the way we tell our heritage story. And by doing so, we will help play our part in the prospective World Heritage Site. We want to ensure that our railway is in good shape and sustainably so as we approach our 200th anniversary and so that we're in a position where we can tell our story to future generations and in doing so help our railway to thrive into the future. Welcome to Boston Lodge. So what are we going to do in this project? Well there are four interconnected strands and it starts with building skills of volunteers and staff and that includes three traineeships and workshops ranging from engineering to archive research. Then we're going to tell our story better and give visitors lots of ways to find out about the heritage of the railway and the landscape. And then we're going to do a lot of work here at Boston Lodge that you can see around you, bringing heritage buildings back into workshop space uh, and making the site work better. And finally, volunteers are the lifeblood of our railway, so we're going to be working more with them and with a more diverse range of people, 
all made possible because of the extra workshop space that we will have. And then underpinning all these four strands is building on our links with the local community so they can have pride in and involvement in this amazing heritage. With generational change, we can feel the history of our railway slipping through our fingers. We want to do something now to capture our stories and make sure that they're shared with future generations. Through our project, we want to foster better relations with the local community. We are a Welsh railway and our history is intertwined for 200 years with the local community. We want to make sure that that continues and that we continue to play our part in the economy and the success of North Wales. The heritage skills that are so essential to the future of our railway are an important feature of our project. Through the Skills for the Future programme, we work with NLHF to give 20 people an opportunity to learn heritage railway skills. Of these, 11 found jobs in the heritage sector and two have gone on to university to study further. Our new project will build on this and give an opportunity to develop skills in areas which mainstream courses do not cater for. Skills essential to the future of our heritage railways. Although much of our heritage is about telling our story, developing skills and giving more opportunity for people to be involved, there is a capital works element to our project too. This focuses on restoring the oldest buildings on Boston Lodge works site. These buildings will then be in good shape to survive another hundred years and have useful roles to play, either as active workshops or as part of a plan to bring new volunteers and visitors to the site. We know that our workshops are fascinating. They are the only workshops that have built steam locomotives in the 19th, 20th and 21st centuries. Normally off limits, we're going to make it possible for visitors to see behind the scenes and learn the history of the workshops. It's not a museum, it's a live operating workshop and the visit experience that we will give will be unique as a result. So in summary, our railway has survived by changing with the times and embracing technology. We want to do that again now to make sure that we remain in really good shape for our 200th anniversary. We will make sure that our team tell our story in a great way. We will put essential skills in the hands of more people. We will save the fabric of our historic workshops and share them with our visitors in a unique way. Byddwn yn cynyddu'r nifer o bobl sy'n cymryd rhan gyda phwyslais ar ein cymuned leol a'n gwirfoddolwyr. The Festiniog and Welsh Highland Railways are a really great family and with the help of NLHF we'll be able to build on decades of hard work and rather than that history slipping through our fingers it can live on for future generations.